Just overall, your three games in now, just the progression of how the defense has progressed from mm -hmm. game one to, to today. Well, I think from week, from week one to current, I think we progressed. I think up front, we've progressed from the standpoint of being able to identify problems with them and then make adjustments in order to see what's going on and, and, and make that adjustment on the field and then go back out and execute it. And I think overall, we haven't been as consistent. There's been some flashes at times we've looked really, really good. At other times, it's not there. And I, I think the, what we need to do next is move, you know, close that gap. So if there's something happening, be able to make that correction but then keep our intensity and emotion the entire game. And we haven't, we haven't sustained it the way we need to. We hear a lot about the rush defense. Again, you gave up a few yards in the first mm -hmm. half. Is, and, and that could be um, Coach talking about a slow start. What can you do maybe to rectify that in the first half and maybe shut that down? Or is that just a, a byproduct of what they ran off offensively? You know, I think today, looking at today's game, uh, I think two things. I think they, they did a very nice job. Um, but we we left a lot of plays on the field. Um, there was we missed some gaps early on. They the, the back popped through, we missed some tackles, popped through, and then there was some play action plays, play action passes where we should have been a little tighter in coverage. You know, so it was a combination. Uh, but but to clean up a fast start, you know, we we've got to come out more intensely. You know, the first thing is to come out with more intensity. We've got to come up. You know, that said, you guys, you've got four picks in your last two games. Dargan's got three of those four. That guy, he, he's got he's got wheels in, in the secondary, back at the safety position. Um, he can really play. You must be thrilled that he's he's performed so well. Yeah. Eric Dargan's been here for five years. Uh, he's never really been a starter up until this year. But what, he, what he's done in, in, in a reserve role is continue to make plays. He's made a lot of plays, but you should see him in practice. Yeah. He makes he makes these plays all the time. Uh, so I'm really happy for him that now he is you know, he's the guy. He's out there, and all the things he's been doing at practice, the world's starting to see him do on the field. Now you head into Pac-12 play. Mm -hmm. You had said earlier that you wanted to get a rotation of about 20 to 24 players. Have you kind of honed that down as you now head into Pac-12 play? You know, I, I'm not sure the exact number, but I think we're, we're close to having two deep and then some, some other guys. So I think we're close to getting that rotation, or excuse me, to getting the numbers, getting the numbers down and how we're going to rotate them. And obviously this week we'll, we'll go over that because now it changes. When we're in conference, it's a different animal. It's, it's, not, it's not two back power teams. It's Washington State spreads you out, gash you with a run. It's a different operation. So now we've got to readjust the, the ones that you yeah. look at what's the best personnel group for this, this next up, upcoming poll. And lastly, let's talk about the, the uh, corners. Um, gave up a few mm -hmm. yards, passing yards in the first mm -hmm. half. But you came back in the second half, got a little bit more pressure on Kirk Guard, um, and the corners did a good job shutting them down. Was that, a, was that a, um, an adjustment that you made in, in, at halftime? You know, at halftime, we, we talked about, you know, two or three things we needed to do. And obviously, the first one was we needed to play harder. We just, we were not flying around. We needed to be caught in the act of being ourselves, flying around. And, and so we came out with a little more intensity, so that took care of number one. Number two, we needed to fit the run a little better. And then three, we needed to be a little tighter in the coverage. And those kids, to a man, all looked at each other and said they were going to do it. And they came out and they, they, they kind of made the adjustment.